What's up, man? Welcome back to another episode of the Lobo. Hey, yeah. And in today's episode, we have the conference championship game on the schedule. A rematch against number 20. The number 20 now. Number 20, Fresno State. Yes, sir. Y'all already know what happened in the previous game against Fresno State. If you don't know, go back and watch it. But anyway, we won. You should know that by now. And we beat them down pretty bad. Can we do it again? I don't know. It's hard to beat a team twice in the same season, but we're going to try to do it. And this is for all the marbles the mountain west conference title game gets a rematch yes sir and it's two top 25 teams yes sir we are number 16 right now we did move up a spot and i like that but if you haven't already make sure you hit that like button subscribe to the channel hit that notification bell that way you be notified the next time i drop a video just like this one also hop in that comment section talk to your boy man come talk to your boy we talk back we friendly it ain't no hard feelings if you don't you know what i'm saying <laughs> Ain't no hard feelings if you don't, but if you like to hop in the live chat, man, come on, get in there with us. You know what I'm saying? But I'm ready to get into this game. What about y'all? I thought so. Let's do it. All right, we got the team stats for the conference championship game. We'll take a look at the Bulldog side. Their offense is good. We already know that on paper. It's good on paper, let me say that, because they didn't perform the last time we played them. Their defense is good on paper as well, but, you know, our offense ran through their defense. Will that be different this game? I have no idea. On the Lobo side, our offense is legit. We're top 20 in everything. Number one as far as points. Number three as far as yards number 15 as far as passing yards and number 10 as far as rushing on the defensive side we're not that good we already know that but this team likes to show up in big games i hope they do it again top players for your lobos we got ian smith terrence rust and cj cj is up there because one of those other players are probably a senior who was up tavian combs was up there i think and tavian combs is a senior this year so yeah top players for the bulldogs we got an 87 overall receiver a 86 overall strong safety and a another 86 overall strong safety and on the injury report robert sullivan is still questionable right now i thought he was gonna be back last game but he wasn't hopefully he'll play this game but if not we got will dennis the menace glad to have you with us dun, in the studio dun, i'm reese davis bringing you the ea dun, sports dun, dun, ncaa dun, dun, football 14 pregame show dun, 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 innovation it's time to as play another said, game now. that means no more time for preparation lots yeah. of time for playing time look at that offense baby Look at that offense. Show, I'm an offensive next, genius. On the call. David Sometimes. <laughs> yeah. It's that time, baby. You know it's time for the conference championship game. Yay! You already know the low bows in this thing. Hey, yeah. So let's win. Again this year. Bitch. I hope Fresno State doesn't leave us in tears. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. This is what these teams have fought for <laughs> all year long. A chance number to be 16 versus number 20. And now it's time for the coin toss. Let's go. Zero. If you're not pumped zero for this game, enjoy everything. I don't know what to tell you. Up a I'm Nate. Okay. We get six. Nate is right up now. over a thousand yards again this year. He's got to worry about that's nice. Football. 18 TDs. All right. Sight is already coming down. All right. A little field back dive. Okay, Luke. Ooh. Damn, Luke. They hit you with the thunder, didn't they? Try to juke. Bam. Maybe they got to get blocked. He doesn't get blocked. That's about right. As soon as I said maybe, I should have just switched the play up. He lets it fly. And overthrows everybody. Doesn't get there. The quarterback didn't get enough on the long ball. Got him. Andrew Erickson. And 
at about the 27. Let go, yard. my boy. All right, so we have two guys with nobody directly over the top of them. Switch that up a little bit. Oh my God! To the tight end, and that ball is incomplete. Okay. Makes it out to about All right. the 16. You talk about a two-track right. guy. And it's going nowhere. Every time, New Mexico's loaded, and they've got one. Every time I try to run the ball with Nate, they just put a whole bunch of guys in the box. And he went all the way around behind him. Good job by the defense to overpower the offensive line and drop the back for a loss. Will Dennis? This is absolute bullshit. Yeah, they say he was out of bounds. Damn. I wish I would have reviewed that. Went back and looked at the replay, and it looked like he got his foot down. But it is what it is. Let's take the three. Ain't no need to whine about it. All right, defense. Let's do it again. Five wide receivers. Takes the ball right. Oh, made him go back inside. Get him. He makes it out to maybe the 36-yard line. Here's a no. Get him. Damn. To about the 38-yard line. Oh, we're on top of that. We on top of that. Swings it out. Right there. About the Caught a block on the outside. Okay. Okay. They really, they running the ball a lot, bro. He throws it out of bounds. He will take that. Out of bounds. Okay. Let's go punt safe. Try to get this safely off the field where he wants it, on the really defensive side. The field position in this football game. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, excellent. We're going to let that go. This punt bounces into the end zone. Okay. And this will be a touchback. Oh, my God. Y'all not going to block that man at all? That'll bring up second and 11. He couldn't get there fast enough. Takes it up there we go. For a nice run. There we go. There it is. Terrence Rust. Let go. And that will be the end of the first quarter. That's a 3-0 lead. I feel good about that right now. All right, we'll take the five. Ian Smith has a thousand yards on the ground this year. Oh boy! There he is. And we lose a yard on it. Hey, oh my! Ian Smith, I thought we got over this, bro. Very high punt. The birds better watch out. Gotcha, bitch. Mm. You know what? It might not have been a lot, but they moved okay. the ball forward. Okay. No. Can't bring him down. Bring him down. The man is down. Damn. Get him. They'll bring him down. Round the 43. There you go. Bring him down. The there you go. Who's that big 88? David? That's a screen. Bitch. And I was right there, and he broke the down tackle. I apologize for my outburst. Bitch. He makes it out to okay. 37. And I was there again. He broke another tackle. Six yards that time on the pass play. Go! 
Complete. He's got room for the 10. Touchdown. Big play. The man threw the ball fading backwards. How can you throw an accurate pass fading Excellent backwards? By the quarterback, making the proper reads and how? Playmaker for the score. You talk about a and how is that not picked play. off or at least batted down? down. Oh, God damn it! God damn it! God damn it! Execution. If you're the defense, you have to do something to try to change things up to get this quarterback out of sync. He's to the 20. At the 30. Uh oh. That man up there is fast. Ah. But we'll take it. Now he's scrambling. He heaves it to the end zone. Oh, no. Oh, my. Intercepted. And who else? Bro, that was going to Terrence Rust. I was throwing the ball to Terrence Rust. Now my freshman QB wants to no want to play like a freshman QB now. Okay. No, no. And there's a missed tackle. He's out to the 30. And he Here we go. At the 36. Here we go. Nice run, and he's brought down. Mm -mm. Makes a catch, and he's got nowhere to go. Get on the throw, he caught it, and they make the stop at about the 37 yard line. Tight ends can really be a wild I need my card best players offense. to make Sometimes plays, man. On the ground, left side. Trick him up, bring him down. About the 36. Bring him down. And of course, we can't get off the field on third down and long. Oh, I almost picked it off. It's incomplete, but get back in this ball game. Short pass, middle of the field. Damn, I got to get there. At about the 15 yard line. Don't let him get it. And he's short. I thought they would kick a field goal, but they're not going to do that. He went out of bounds. That penalty will move him back a bit. Bruh, I swear, man. I swear. He's on the run. Pressure coming. Out of bounds around the 21 yard line. Complete brought down. Nothing to Hurry up. He didn't have much of a chance on that play. Oh, this they call timeout. And nobody's blocking. I did not want to play action. As an offense, God, it's doing. He's scrambling. I see you. I see you, Trace. I see you, Trace. Now he tries to buy some time. He's under some heat. Damn, I can I get away from him? It fly. Incomplete. And it hit Omar on a damn hill, man. Football here. Fresno State's up by four. And we're losing. Shit! Shit! We played 30 minutes. Glad we can only come up with on three points in a whole half. half show Had several missed Nissan. opportunities. Innovation. Had several open wide Dave receivers. And, I here in the studio to break and we had several overthrown passes. First half. This is everything or passes to the complete. Being. To the we're <laughs> going to be riveted to this game, I feel like, David, in the second half. <laughs> he threw that one pass. That one right there. It's, it's fun. It's, it's to the wrong receiver, the bro. Every single time. We can't even turn the channel here. We got it it was so far off that it went to the it's other receiver. Nice, by the way, too. The weather's nice and warm. It's beautiful. Got some chips. We're opening them up a little bit. But great game. He's not Living playing like he height. played in the last two or like three games. Are evenly matched. It feels like it can go I don't know if the moment is too big for him or what. But look at our offensive output. Is that's terrible. Oh, that Both is terrible. I wish I could say that turnover was on me, no physical, but it was not, bro. Each other, the big plays. 
don't come down to a finesse kick. <laughs> the pass was so player. far Steve off. David's ready to get back on that couch. Get the that it went in the direction of another receiver. What's going on around That's how far off it was. Get you back for your second half. Brad and Kirk ready to roll. Feeds it to the back. Bring him down. Runs it left for a decent game. Nope. He's taken Cannot down. bring him down. Yeah, of course. The Threw the ball before the man even broke on his route. Now he shows his running ability. He's tackled right around the Bro, we getting beat down right now. Force him back inside. Finish him. Dang, we got him that time. Finally got to him. Had to send both safeties, but I got to him. Ain't no way. Thank you. Well, here the quarterback makes a poor decision throwing into coverage. We got the stop that we need to get. Kicks up, and the field goal is good. Still a one possession game. Scrambling around. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. <sighs> Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Okay. He scrambled. He's a pressure and he's tackled. And I really don't want to be running with him like this. I ain't got no choice. They'll bring him down at the 31. Only two yards on it. He's scrambling. Even though they didn't Just throw it away. He's on the run. And he dropped it. Of course. He dropped it. And not pick up the makes it out to maybe the 40 yard line. No. Get back there. Take it down to the backfield. They couldn't get back to the line of scrimmage on that one. Well, I don't think they did a very good job of selling the pass. Let's go, the defense. defense. Read the play. Bring him down, Cody Moon. Well, I don't think he got anything on that. Get over there. Bring him down. There we go. We needed that. And Ian Smith is yeah. out for the game. Fields the pot at the 16, heading for the corner. Ain't gonna be able to get around him. He gets to okay, CJ. You gotta get Nate going, bro. Okay. There we go, Nate. There we go, Nate. Let's go. Let's go. It's Big Nate. Another great run by the Heisman hopeful. If he keeps playing like that, he's going to be filling Everybody up his Everybody type with Big Nate in the chat play. right now. Oh, my God. He on X Games mode. And number 12, oh, Georgia, Georgia takes down number 10, Arkansas, 35 to 30. Their hot streak continues. The and that was the conference championship five. game. Woo pig. Right, Bring him down. Nice run, and he's brought down. And still on his feet. Oh my god. Get to him. We gotta put him behind the eight ball. Nullifying out the blocks up front, and that allowed the linebacker to roam free and make the tackle in the backfield. Surprise, motherfucker. Bring him down. Let go, AJ Odom. Receivers coming over the middle, taking shots from 21, the 21, 21. Who's still in the backfield? This guy just flies all over the field. And that will be the end of the third quarter, so and it's a tie game. And a, a whole lot different game. than the previous game, ain't it? Fresno State decided they wanted to show up today, at least on the defensive side. Or either our offense just didn't show up. Put your foes up. 
Trip him up. Bring him down. Let's go, Omar. Big stop. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. No. He's out to the 30. They'll bring him down at the 33-yard line. Okay. And that man got off the block. The formation. And the screen pass. Didn't hold the block long enough. Monty with a nice play fake. And threw it out of bounds. Gets him to go three and out. Good job here defensively. Rodriguez awaits the snap. Oh, excellent punt. He's to the 40. And he's taken down at the 43 yard line. On the ground. Bring him down. He fights forward to about the 46. And they back up three. We on your head, board. boy. They really just didn't have any room to work on that play. The we on your head, boy. Your cat can get peeled. You know what it is. Get him down. Get him down. Go punt safe, man. Because I don't trust these guys. The CPU. And we'll let it go. Yeah. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. I have to try to run the offense with CJ. Oh man. And he's taken down. And we get two yards. Line. There's a player down. I'm not sure what happened. And now Nate's hurt. Bro, I can't make this up, man. Can't make it up. Somebody gonna have to do something. Omar, Terrence. Who gonna do something? And he overthrows him. He's unable to hit his receiver. Fuck. Over the Damn it. There we go. And up for the first down. And they make the stop. The there we 37th. go. Now he tries to buy some time with the pass <laughs> incomplete. <laughs> he's scrambling. Throws it deep. And he throws it to him. Pulls it in and he's in the open field. Oh, I thought I juked him. He's tackled at the 20-yard line. Finally got something to go down for you. I thought I juked him. He fell right into me. <laughs> Look at that. No blocking, man. And Nate is out four weeks. Four weeks. Oh, hell no. What we gonna do, bruh? Terrence Rust, Omar, do something. This one's going deep to the end zone. He's all There's right. a touchdown. touchdown. Nicely designed play to the wide receiver. Did he get his feet down? You said it, Brad. Actually, his foot is in the ground. <laughs> he got a foot down. All right, it's in the ground. <laughs> I ain't got no problem with the defense right now. Except that. Complete. He's got room. Why did I speak on it? <laughs> as soon as I speak on it, we leave somebody wide open. I ain't gonna say nothing else. No. Bring him down. The other Omar. Gets rid of it quickly. Wide it's open. First down and he's out of bounds. This is what happens when you go zone. Two zones, two wide open receivers. I believe I can Dang, I can't let you sit back there long enough and pass the ball. Two to go in the game. He goes okay. out of bounds. Around the 44 you had it. There's a strike complete. All he got to do is turn around, around, man. The ball quarter. coming right at him. There's a screen. 
Come on, man. Not going for that. Oh my caught end zone for the touchdown. <laughs> Left the man the wide quarter, open. But the man already, somebody is already covering that man. So it's a three man deep. You got one on the left, you got one in the middle, and you got one on the right. Okay. So the cornerback has this guy. He got him underneath. He's going towards the middle. There's already a safety in the middle. Why would you, on the far back at the left, why would you go that far away from this receiver that's on the sideline over here? There's no way he can get the ball right there. You leave him wide open. And of course, he dropped it. I don't think we've ever had this many drops in a game all season. Just drop after drop after drop. He's on the run. Gets it out in a hurry. Mm -hmm. And he threw it out of bounds. I'm putting cases on all you bitches. Huh? You think you can do this shit? Yay! Yay! Bro, what? What is going on? Oh, damn it. That's like the third time they done done that today. Flip shot uh, middle to the running back. I'm coming for that. I'm coming for that. They just gonna run the clock down. I ain't gonna even lie. At this point, I'm okay with that. I really am. He wants it all. Bat it down. There we go. And we going to overtime. That's the end of the fourth quarter, and we are headed to overtime. And down he goes. And we got to try to score without both of my top players on the offensive side. And here we go. CJ. CJ. CJ say he still got some magic left in him. Well, this is what it's all about in college football. I score. Now we'll see if you can respond. We're going to make it hard on you, my boy. We're going to make it hard on you. I'm sitting in the heat. Slow him down. There we go. There we go. Bring them down! Way too much time. That man was back there for three days. And they really... They really run it? You gotta be kidding me. What do you think this was? Huh? Bitch! Really great game to watch. Both teams should be proud of their efforts. It's this the game. Lobos, baby. Mexico, 24, Fresno State, 17. As we wrap this game up, Kirk, what final thoughts do you want to share? I hope well, later be back for the bowl game, but I don't think it's going to happen. Come in and it We're going to have to win without him. Fresno State but really he did contribute to this had, win. Just didn't have enough left in their tank. Once we didn't do a whole lot on the team. offensive side, but the defense, the defense kept us in this game. CJ made a play in overtime to give us the lead. And he got to play other game just off of that. For New Mexico, they just keep winning in what has been a And we win the Mountain West Conference the Bulldogs, they lose this for the second the straight time. Gives them a nine and four record. Two times in a row. We've won both years that I've been here. I don't know how that was an interception, but it is what it is. There's Nate with the big run again to give us our first touchdown of the game in the second half, I might add. We only had three points at halftime. 
Yeah, and somehow we left that guy wide open to tie the game up in the fourth quarter. And then CJ runs it in for the TD in overtime. Oh, man. I don't know what to say. All right, we got the player stats here. Ian Smith went 7 of 14 for 80 yards and an interception. He was not playing his best game, and he got injured. On top of that, he will be back next game, though. CJ stepped in and went 4 of 11 for 79 yards and a TD. Only completed 36% of his passes. We know CJ is very, very inconsistent on top of being inaccurate. On the rushing side, we got Nate leading all rushes with 75 yards on 8 attempts and a TD. He did get hurt as well before the game ended, which cut on his stats short of what I thought they were going to be. On the receiving side, we got Terrence Rust leading all receivers with 71 yards on five receptions and a TD. We got Andrew Erickson also chipping in with 33 yards on two receptions. Trace also had a reception for 31 yards. Not much going on in the passing game, and y'all can tell by the passing yards. On the defensive side, we got Taven Combs leading all tacklers with seven solo tackles, one assisted and one TFL. He also had a sack. Ray Luitele had six solo tackles and four tackles for a loss. Also had a pass deflection. Cody Moon had five solo tackles, one assisted, and two tackles for a loss. Omar Duram had five solo tackles, three tackles for a loss, and two sacks. Connor Sillis also had five solo tackles and a tackle for a loss and a sack. AJ Odoms also had five solo tackles and a tackle for a loss. He also had a pass deflection. All right, let's take a look at the game stats. There wasn't a whole lot of stats on the offensive side. It was more of a defensive battle today. Your Lobos had an early 3-0 lead. Fresno State comes back with a seven-point victory in the second quarter we go to the third and we go 7-3 and then it was tied in the fourth which led to overtime we scored a TD with CJ and we get a stop on the defensive side and we get the win 24-17 we lost the first down battle we won a rushing yard battle surprisingly we lost the passing yard battle of course we did have that one turnover which was terrible and we lost the time of possession battle offensive player of the game of course it went to CJ we already seen that the defensive player of the game goes to Omar Duram with five tackles three tackles for a loss and two sacks all right and your new mexico lobos are mountain west champions again let's add that trophy to the profile all right and the halfback from central michigan lou nichols has won a heisman this year congratulations to lou nichols we didn't get a player in there for the heisman voting but that's okay I would trade that in for a 12-win season any day. And we are invited to the SRS Las Vegas Bowl. And we will go up against number 12, Stanford. So <laughs> we're going to find out how good this team is this year against a team outside of the Mountain West Conference. Hopefully we show up and show out. We didn't really show up against Fresno State, but we got the victory. Hopefully we can get another one and get 13 wins on the season. And me, your HC, I have won the AP coach of the year again they might as well just make up a trophy and give it to me again so i can already have a trophy for next year <laughs> but we will add that to the profile all right let's take a look at the top 25 as uab moved up to number one miami moves up to number two Oregon moves up to number three. Syracuse drops down to number four after they lose to Miami. And that game looks like it was close. So we will have UAB going up against Syracuse and Miami versus Oregon. I really don't see anything wrong with that other than we have a three loss Notre Dame team ranked above Ohio State. I really don't like that. Really don't like Alabama being ranked above Ohio State either. But I don't know what happened in that loss. I don't know if they got blew out. Who did they lose to? Actually, let's get some more info on it oh they just lost recently that's why yeah you can't do that they lost before the conference championship game you cannot do that they lost in overtime but it is what it is and we'll scroll on down to finish out the top 25 utah also lost they lost to oregon bad 38 to 14 which dropped them all the way out of the number three spot down to 10. let's see is there any other big movements going on here arkansas lost to georgia which drops them from 10 to 15. your lobos are still sitting at 17 right now after our close victory over fresno state anything 
anything else that looks different houston is a new team in the top 25 at 10 and 2 i guess we can take a look at the all americans see if we have any first team all americans and we do ray luitele the middle linebacker the senior going out with an all american selection shout out to you ray and we got hunter sellers the cornerback he's a junior he'll be back next year and we got tavian combs probably the best defensive player on the field he's a senior and he's going out with an all-american selection freshman we got ian smith of course probably the best freshman in the country shout out to quincy mcadoo i'm gonna tell y'all a little story about quincy mcadoo quincy actually went to my high school here in clarendon well i live in holly grove Clarendon is only 10 minutes away. So Quincy went to Clarendon High School, Clarendon Holly Grove to be exact. And he is actually on the Arkansas Razorback roster right now. He played DB this year. He switched from receiver to DB and he gave he gave our team a boost. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not just gonna say that because he's from the area I'm from. He gave the Arkansas Razorbacks a big boost on the defensive side. So shout out to Quincy McAdoo. But let's continue on. Um, do we have anybody else? I don't think so. We didn't have that many freshmen. Nasty Nate finished number 11 in the Maxwell. Not bad. He finished number three in the Walter Camp. Taven Cones finished number four in the Bed Eric. Nasty Nate also finished number three for the Walker. And I don't think there is any more awards after this. I will look and see, but if not, that's it. Oh, Tavian Combs finished number six for the Thorpe. Can't leave Tavian Combs out, the senior. All right, so if you made it to this part of the episode, you already know how it go on this show. It's the outro. Bitch. Finally made it to bowl season. We got us a real good win against Fresno State again. I knew that that team was not going to come out like they did in the previous game where we just blew them out of the water. I don't know what happened in that game. I don't know if we just came out on fire and just, I don't know, stunned them. I don't know what happened. But this was a close game. Went all the way to overtime. It was a defensive battle, I should say. It was a defensive battle, I will say. But we did the most important thing, and that's get the W. Now we have to move on to bowl season. We have to go up against number 12 Stafford and try to get a bowl game victory. Something we haven't done so far in the series. We've won the conference championship. We've won 12 games. Actually, we won two conference championships. We haven't won a bowl game yet. Now is the time. Ian Smith is healthy. He will be back for this game. I looked at the injury report. Nate is not out. He will be playing in this game. We will be at full strength. Robert Sullivan is back, the tight end. So we'll have all our guys. And all our guys will go down swinging. Hopefully, we don't go down. <laughs> I really hope that we don't go down. But if you haven't already, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell. Also, hop in the comments, talk to your boy. You know what I'm saying? We be watching, we be looking, we be talking. And if you comment enough, you will get on this shout out list. Shout out to Product Visuals, Optimal Prime 870, The Rapper 10,000, aka The General, Warmaster 777, Thomas Bays, Arsenio Patillo, Eric Rams, Dare, Matt Aarons, DRNA Patterson, Andrew Minton, Roscoe underscore 34, Clips, Slapshark 23, Ethan Marlowe, JK YouTube, Eaglecraft, Little Her Guy, Tony Hawkins, Jordan Barker, Tim Alvarez, Afro Magic, Smoking 8609, and Caleb Parker. And like I say in every episode, I really do appreciate every last single one of you guys and girls but i ain't gonna hold y'all up too much longer i am your hc this is the lobo series next episode the bowl game the finale to the season well the final actual episode we will have the off season live stream as well i will drop the uh, discord link in the chat as well if you want to join the discord and get your low bowl recruits in early i will also do a community post on that as well i'm out